Hey, it's Lindsay, and this is your 15 minute full body, no equipment workout. Let's do it. All right, let's go ahead and get started with a quick full body warm up. So start by circling those arms as always. Go ahead and circle them backwards. The way this workout is gonna work is we have five different exercises and they're each gonna be one minute long. We have a two minute warm up and a three minute cool down. So let's go ahead and switch to twists, moving that stomach and let's add my favorite little high knee to that. Good, and let's add a high knee skip. Good. We have about a minute and 15 until we get started. So we're just getting moving right now. Let's go ahead and warm up some squats. So down and up, trying to keep those feet flat on the floor and keep those shoulders up to the sky. Not letting your chest fall down. Good, and let's go ahead and stretch our quad and the other one. Good, and let's start at the back of our mat and we're gonna walk, stretch out our hamstring. Good, and reach over. Last one, and backwards. Very nice. Let's reach up to the sky and back down. Walk those hands out. Let's do a push-up and go into a cobra stretch. Good, and let's add a real push-up. Good, and one knee push-up. Nice, back up to push-up shape and walk those hands in. And we are ready to get started. First exercise is high bicycles. So we're keeping our, our upper back off the ground on these. So here, sitting up and bringing those knees to those elbows. Good, really using your abs to stay upright and finding that perfect balance spot on your butt. So you're not tipping over. Sometimes it can be hard to find, but eventually you will find it. If you need to, for the meantime, you can put your hands down on the ground and use them to help you balance, or you can switch to regular low bicycles. Good, keep it up. We have 20 seconds left. Our next exercise is gonna be push-up, arm raise overhead, arm raise side, then arm raise back. And we have 10 seconds. In three, two, one, switch to that push-up position. And here we go. Push-up, arm raise to the front. Push-up, same arm to the side. Push up, same arm to the back. Good. Now we're gonna go push up, other arm to the front. Push up, other arm to the side. Push up, other arm to the back. Good, if you need to make this a little bit easier, you can go knee push up, arm to the front. Knee push up, arm to the side. And push up, arm to the back. Good. 15 more seconds. And back. Good, last push up. Let's do one overhead each side. Last one, good. And here we go into our next exercise, dead bugs. So laying on the ground, 90 degree angle, keeping that lower back on the ground, arms up. And we are switching alternate arm, alternate leg. Good. Making sure you're keeping that core engaged. And doing that is making it very hard to talk right now. Good. Keeping that core tight, alternating arm, alternating leg. If you need to, you can take it slow at first just to figure out the right pattern. 20 seconds. 
Good, keep it up. And 10 seconds. Next exercise, our standing. So we're gonna be doing squats with close feet. So we're here, our feet are about hip width or just slightly wider. And we're keeping our knees going straight over top of our toes. And we're squatting down and up. Usually I like to squat slightly outwards, but this works your inner legs just a little bit more. So we're gonna switch it up and do it like this today. Let's see it from the side. Good. Keep it moving. If you can move faster than I am, then definitely do that. Good, 20 seconds. Making sure you're still maintaining that upward chest and you're keeping your feet flat on the ground. Next exercise is prone bent leg lower body raises. So we're lifting up both of our legs at the same time and we're on our belly and we're going to lift up using our lower body. Trying to keep those legs going up to the ceiling and using that back to lift upright. Isolating that lower back. Just a small movement and lifting up. 30 seconds. Good. And squeeze and down. 15 seconds left. And then we're going back to those high bicycles. And five seconds. And three, two, one. And here we go. Switching over to laying on our back and getting ready to lift up and staying off the ground while rotating. Try and touch that elbow to that knee. Good. Really using that core to bring those legs in and keep balanced. 30 seconds. If you ever need to take a break, just sit down, take a second, and get right back into it if you can. Good, 20 seconds left. Remember, if you need to, you can always put those hands on the ground. If you are struggling to make it, then just put those hands down and get through it. In five seconds, and three, two, one. Good, next exercise, push up, arm raise overhead. So trying to stay square to the ground, not rotating when we do this, so not opening up. You're trying to keep those shoulders facing the ground. So lifting straight up overhead, push up, lift to the side, back down and to the back. Good. and other side. Push up, overhead, push up, lift to the side, push up, and back. And remember, if you need to, you can always switch to that knee variation, to the side, 15 seconds, to the back, last side. Front and side and back. Good, nice job. Switch over to the back, going into dead bugs. So, lifting up with our shoulders, knees in 90 degree angles, arms mirroring that angle, and here we go, alternating and alternate. So right arm, left leg go down and back up, and then left or right leg, left arm go down and switch. Good, this takes a little bit of focus at first, but you will get the hang of it. Remembering to keep those shoulders off the ground and keep breathing through this. 
Good, 10 seconds left. Keep engaging that core. Good, and three, two, one. Back to standing up for our close foot squats. So here, feet just about hip width. They're a little bit wider. Squatting down and up. Good. Keeping that chest upright and those feet flat on the ground. Good. Let's see if we can move a little bit faster for these last 30 seconds. Good. We have 20 seconds left and then one more exercise and then a quick three minute cool down. A little reward after you've done a lot of work. Good, almost there. Five seconds and three, two, one. Prone, laying on our belly, bent leg, lower body raises. So just using your lower body to initiate this small lift, isolating those glutes and those hamstrings, and lift. Trying not to rock back and forth. We are isolating, so just do the tiniest little lift, engaging our lower body. More than halfway there. Good, 20 seconds. And lift, keep in a rhythm. And 10 seconds, almost there. And three, two, one. Good, and let's stretch out our back by reaching up to the sky and over our legs and just relaxing. Good. And let's reach up to the sky again. And this time we're gonna reach even farther past our legs and holding. Good, reach up, last one. And down to the ground, and let's do walking legs. Good, reach up 
and set that knee down and relax back. And two, one. Put those elbows on the ground. Last five seconds. And three, two, one, and time. Very good job today, you guys. Make sure to hit the like button if you like this video and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks so much for working out with me today. Let me know in the comments how that workout went for you and also make sure to leave me a like if you like this video. I release a new workout just like this one every day, so make sure to subscribe to my channel so you can see all the new workouts. Also, if you wanna get even fitter, check out this video. I'll see you guys tomorrow.